What is up, Justin with Santa Fe, and today I wanna to talk about condensation on your windows in the winter months, and what does that mean? Do I need a dehumidifier? Do I not need a dehumidifier? The question comes up a lot this time of year. Uh, when people see moisture on their windows, they think they need a dehumidifier, but that's not always the case. So we see condensation on our windows because the surface temperature of that window has dropped below the dew point temperature. And it's not uncommon in the winter season for your window surface temperature to be below the dew point temperature. As temperatures drop outside, that's gonna make the surface temperature of our windows even cooler, causing moisture to collect and build on those windows. Now, a couple ways to prevent that. One, we first wanna find out if you need a dehumidifier or not. Typically, you don't if you're in a cooler environment. Conditions are already dry enough. Uh, if your temperature and relative humidity are low enough to the point where a dehumidifier is not gonna do anything for you, we don't wanna talk you into a dehumidifier because we know that it's gonna lead to a, a callback. You're not gonna get any dehumidification on that space. So if you're already at 70 degrees and below 40% relative humidity, a dehumidifier is really not gonna do anything for you. A couple things to factor in. One, uh, we want to increase the surface temperature of that window, and we want to make sure that we're getting as much airflow on those windows as possible. And then we also want to make sure our bath fans are running continuously when we're taking showers and baths and things, uh, where bulk moisture uh, can, can build up in the home. So run your bath fans as much as possible in the winter months. The other thing you want to do is keep your heat at a consistent temperature. Don't fluctuate it because that can change the surface temperature of the window. You can drop that surface temperature. And the other thing you want to do is keep your blinds open as much as possible. Keeping your blinds open also helps heat and airflow get to those windows and that'll help increase the surface temperature of the window. Now, ventilation may be a piece too uh, where you want additional ventilation uh, in your home to get your, your, your space even drier. But like I said, usually in the winter months, your space is already dry enough and additional ventilation, drier air coming into your home may cause conditions that are too dry. Um, so this is the time of year people tend to add moisture to their house because you know, as they see relative humidity below 35% at 70 degrees on average, people tend to get a little bit uncomfortable. Uh, you, know, you start to see dry skin, cracked skin, uh, maybe bloody noses, things like that as it tends to get too dry. So. Long and short of it, you tend to not need dehumidification when you see condensation on your windows in the winter season or winter months. I'll go into a little bit more detail on this in another video, but until next time, uh, stay tuned for more quick tips from Santa Fe and Ultra Air by Santa Fe. Take care and make it a great day.